Please, accept my apologies. I am Noir, the head of the Church of the Divine Mother. I'm pleased to make your acquaintance. Why did you stop him? Wouldn't it be better for you if he had burned the forest to a crisp and us with it? Only a barbarian would burn down a beautiful forest like this. Some talk coming from you. There seems to have been some kind of misunderstanding. Random destruction is not our goal. We merely want a place that we can call home. You mean your utopia? Utopia? Ha! What kind of utopia requires the deaths of so many innocent people? I don't expect you to understand. We are polar opposites, after all. But remember one thing. We have our own system of right and wrong, just as you do. Hey, don't you want to finish us off? To me, you are nothing more than ants. Not even worth stepping on. Quite a mouth, boy. I think you need to learn some manners. And I'm gonna be your teacher. I can kill you at any time if you get in my way, or if I just feel like it. For now, you should thank your goddess that I'm letting you live. We're nothing to him, huh? He makes me sick. So that's the head of the Church of the Divine Mother. I had imagined somebody scarier. Now, Kulat, you mustn't judge people by their appearance. Just now, when he banished that demon, he was holding back, but he still has the power of a demonic lord. If he were to use all of his power... Hmm, he's nothing to be afraid of. Next time I see him, I'll wipe the floor with his face.
Know it at the time, but the events leading up to the final showdown between the Maiden of Light and the Dark Prince were already beginning to unfold. Soon, we would know the tragic ending to our story. <laughs>